everyone, this is Judy with JLB Crafts. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, thank you so much for giving me a try. Today I'm going to be planning in my wellness planner for the week of January 11th through the 17th. Uh, so let's get going. So this is just a normal vertical planner. This is the Stargazer planner, um, and I print my own prompts if you're new here. I print my own prompts, and they're based on the original... Um, wellness planner extension pack that Happy Planner came out with several years ago. I fell in love with it. Um, it helped me out during a hard time and I just have always uh, kept that. Plus it gives me the flexibility to turn any vertical planner that I fall in love with into my wellness planner. So instead of exercise I do keto and then this left side is a bunch of journaling and, and currently prompts. So what my intuition told me is up in the rotation for next week and then the rest of these there's a set of five um, journaling currently prompts not really journaling because they're just one word answers um, watching feeling positive word listening to and reading and I just print these using a um, spreadsheet program on full sheet sticker paper and then I use a straight edge and a craft knife to kiss cut them myself. That looks like more than five, but no, nope, that's right. And then the bottom row of the original wellness planner was always a set of journaling prompts. Um, so that's what these are. I'm just gonna put these right on the page. So for the, those of you that are new, I use the bottom row as journaling, just like the original. I use the top row of boxes for um, decoration and motivation. And then I use the middle row of boxes for a bunch of stuff. I do food diary. I don't really count calories or anything. I'm keto. Um, water intake and exercise. I do cardio every other day. And so this keeps me, helps me keep track of duration and <clears throat> the bike settings and all of that stuff. So, okay, so this is what my page setup looks like. I'm going to use one of the very first Kaiser Craft sticker books I ever got. I don't know what the name of it is, and it's only half thickness. There's only one copy of every page. I actually got this on Amazon, um, and it might still be available. I'll, I can see if I can find a link for it. Um, but I just love, for me, January says ice and snow and blue. Um, so I love that the pages in the Stargazer are blue, um, and I plan on using them a lot this month. So let's go ahead. I like to pick out of the Kaiser Craft sticker books almost always have a page of words um, and they almost always have a page of washi um, strip stickers. So I thought I would use, I like two that kind of coordinate. Um, so I think I'll use these two navy blue ones with the gold foil, not because of the gold foil, but just because they're both um, navy blue and then I can use the white words so that they stand out. So I'm going to pull these and then I want to go back to the words and I like to usually pull um, a couple long quotes and a weekend banner out of the words. So let's first go to the white. I want a feeling and a positive word. Um, so I'm just kind of reading down through here. I like magical. This actually says so magical, but I could cut the so off and just make it magical. I think that's a positive word. Hopefully this year is magical, eventually. So I'm going to cut off so and just grab magical. And then for that's positive word and then feeling um, I like be different uh, I like be different is it gonna fit yes Okay. Don't be like the rest of them, darling. I just put that quote in my um, social media planner for this week. So, okay. And then, oh, hair. And then I think um, rather than white 
um, down here. I want more of this navy blue to kind of spread it around. So I'm going to go to the second page of words, which are always exactly the same, just a different color. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, um, she who is brave is free. We'll put that somewhere. Be in love with your life. I like that. <clears throat> if not now, when? Shine like the stars. You are worth it. I like you are worth it. It's easy to forget. I think I'll use that as my weekend banner. Okay, so let's put this off to the side. So you, you all know I like to do more of the functional stuff first. I need um, Sunday, so I need Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday for workout boxes. So this is the um, sticker book that came in the Joann's combo yay be happy it wasn't a be happy box but i think it was like the yay box or something um so i i'm pretty sure you can't get this anymore but it had these three blue boxes that i thought i could use as my workout boxes so just lots of different shades of blue this week hopefully enough that they they don't clash they kind of feel cohesive by the end that was all i wanted that book for I have some new bullet points. Those of you who have watched me before, you know I like to order off of AliExpress, the Asian equivalent of Amazon. And I found these adorable little heart bullet points. So I'm gonna use these for my breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack. I have this, this straggler sheet of a few um, blue snowflakes that I thought I could maybe mix in there. We'll see, we'll see. I'm not sure those are gonna be, those might clash a little too much with the color palette. And then I have my hydration stickers and my scale. I think I want to use this lightest blue because um, I don't have any more of this dark blue and that one's edging a little too far in the green direction. So let's start sticking. Um, we'll start with the hydration and scale stickers. So I only weigh in once a week, kind of Monday, Tuesday-ish. And I will link all of this stuff that I can in the description box of the video. Okay, so let's start with, um, oh, I forgot. I like to pull words and put them above keto. Um, it's just a little more encouragement. You are worth it, I like that. See the good. How about why not? I like that. Why not? Um, just debating. Do I want navy blue up there to match with these? I kind of think maybe I do. Why not? We'll come back to this book. So when I do my stack up, I have this kind of open-ended journaling prompt, whereas the rest of these are just a word. So I like to start at the top, start at the top. Sorry, I'm trying to talk too fast. I like to start at the top and work my way down a little bit and then come up from the bottom so that I maximize the amount of space I have for that open-ended journaling prompt. So I just covered up the word notes and I'm centering everything here. And then I'm gonna just keep stacking. I'm just trying to butt this right up against the bottom of the keto sticker, there we go. And now for the next one, I'll come up from the bottom. Like I said, so I maximize that space. So we'll switch, I wanna, um, Go back and forth between these instead of putting them all in a row. So, so I'm just going to leave a little space to write in the answer to this question, which is watching. So we have been watching 
We rewatched the first season of Mandalorian and now we are in the middle of the second season of Mandalorian. There we go. We took a break from, we were rewatching all the seasons of Great British Baking, which I have to admit uh, has a tendency to give us munchies. <laughs> um, so we're taking a little bit of a break from that and watching Mandalorian, um, like I said. And I, I don't know what's next after that. Okay, there's feeling. Next is listening to. I have to admit that I am still, for the next couple days until we take our Christmas tree down, I am still listening to Christmas music. Um, 12 Days of Christmas. I never knew until I was an adult that the 12 days of Christmas actually started on Christmas Day and are still going on. We're getting near the end. Um, and that's, we leave our Christmas tree up through the 12th day of Christmas. Um, so I will be taking that down here in the next few days. And I think that'll probably be about the time I switch away from Christmas music. During the summer, I like to listen to reggae. Um, I'm thinking maybe I will look for some kind of warm, bluesy jazz. I, we have Spotify, um, and I like experimenting with their different music lists. Um, so I may look for some kind of, like I said, bluesy jazz kind of a channel to listen to next. I don't know. Okay, so there is my stack up. I love it. So pretty. I like the white words in between the navy blue washi tape stickers. Okay. So next, I think I will go ahead and get my super pointy tweezers. So these are actually apply for applying artificial eyelash extensions or eyelashes. Um, I will link these in the description box. I just got them on Amazon. And I'm gonna go ahead and fill in my food diary um, spaces and my workout boxes. So I just put four bullet points on each day for breakfast, lunch, dinner, snack. tweezers I think. Next I think I want to put the smallest one you are so worth it kind of over here is my weekend banner so I'm just gonna kind of center it across Saturday and Sunday. There we go and then uh, call me crazy it's just the way my brain works this one is slightly longer so I'm gonna put it over here where there are four columns instead of three. Again, just kind of centered. And this one I'm going to put over here. There we go. Okay, and get rid of my wax paper. So now all we have left at this point is decoration. So let's, I think I want to try to pull in, there is some brown in this book brownish. So I think I want to pull in a little bit of brown up here if I can. There we go. It's kind of brown um, to tie in these little hearts a little bit more, I think. Ooh, do what they think you can't do. I like that a lot. So this book isn't planner stickers. It's just general stickers for like gift tags and card making and whatever you want to use it for. So you'll see some different to and from, um, but you can cover that up. I like this Just Breathe as well. And it's another shade of blue. Um, let me just keep flipping. You are my favorite. You are my happiness. It's a beautiful day. 
I do like these hearts. I might have to bring one of these navy hearts in. Maybe, let's see, I've got navy. I could put it over here. I'm going to do that. I'm going to pull one of these. Um, what else? Remembering that Just Breathe sticker is back there. These stickers are great for layering. Um, a gift for you, definitely a gift tag. XOX. Breathe it all in, love it all out. I think I like that Just Breathe sticker better. What's that say? You make me so very happy. More hearts. Those are just the outlines I used to those. It's hard to tell. I like these leaves too. Those are just the two word pages. Yep. Happy, 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 happy. Make your dreams happen. Inspire. I like inspire too. Okay, I am going to pull Just Breathe. Um, and I, def I think I want that Inspire. Um, so I have this light blue for one side. I could put, oops, I could put this one, Live in the Moment on the other side, be a little wild also. Just looking for this other, a second sticker in this same shade of blue. I like just live in the moment. Okay, so I've got two of the medium blue. I've got two of kind of like the the burlap looking. I have one dark. Do I need another dark? I could layer. I could do some layering. I like to do layering lots of times in this book or in this um, spread. It's a beautiful day. And actually now that I'm looking at it, I don't know if you can tell on camera. This is two different shades. Um, this one's kind of a white and this one's kind of a tan. So now I'm wondering if I want to grab this It's a Beautiful Day because that definitely matches. That does not. Let's do that. I'm going to put Inspire back there. I, there's nothing that says I can't put words in here. I wonder if there was an Inspire on one of these pages. Um, if there was, I might have used it because I'm not seeing it. Okay. Live Simply Love Greatly. Yo. <laughs> That's odd. <laughs> okay. So... I like it's a beautiful day for Monday morning. Um, those tans don't quite match, so I don't want to put them right next to each other. Like that. And then to put the other tan one over here. I'm going to have to put the tan against that one. That's okay. I think I want it down here so that they're staggered. Just kind of, since it's too big for one column, I'm going to evenly space it across the two. Okay, and then blue. Um, these two are very similar in shape, so I think I'll put this one over here. live in the moment. And then I wanted this dark one over here. 
There we go. Just breathe. I kind of like that stacked. Okay, need something for there. I'm gonna get rid of the noisy wax paper. Maybe a big circle, because I got a circle there. Let's look for a big circle, some kind of... I know there was a page that had big circles. There we go. Happy birthday? Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> um, say yes to new adventures. Just lovely. Ooh, there's Inspire again, but it's white. Could I layer it with something? What if I layer that with some of these leaves or... Here we go. What if I layer it with this? If I go like this. I like that. Okay, that's a keeper. We're doing that. There we go. That filled that space in nicely. Do I want a little something? Maybe this blue somewhere? Do I have a little one of those? Yeah, there's little ones. Okay, let's grab a little one. And this one I think I'm gonna put sideways. So it's not too matchy matchy. And then if I had a little word that came off of there, layered off of there, I'd go back to my white words. I think that'll be a nice echo of the theme, but not exactly the same. Um, joy. Just be. Be you. Start somewhere. I like that. Start somewhere. I'm actually thinking I want to do this. Start. somewhere is that straight ish yep okay I think I think that's maybe it the only th other thing I could consider would be putting a little couple some things on either side of those which I like to do sometimes I have those ooh I have a couple of those hearts in that color Hi, Calcifer. Are you coming up to say hi? Come on up. No? He just wants food. He wants crunchies. Oh, I forgot about my snowflakes. Um, are they going to match? Mm, kind of, sort of. Not really, huh? Okay, we'll save those. Um, since I have the printed stuff over here, I think I'm going to leave, I'm not going to put another one on either side. I'm just going to leave it right like that. So no Franken planning required this week, um, because I used the blue pages last week. Uh, and I put my blue discs in on, I moved, did my transformer set up and move in. I can link that in the cards up above. Um, if you want to see how I set up my transformer planner, but there we go. That is my spread for the week of January. Oh, and there goes Calcifer <laughs> for the week of, of January 11th through the 17th. Uh, you're blocking my light, buddy. <laughs> Sorry about the cat tail there. <laughs> um, there's my wellness, health and wellness spread uh, for the first week in January, the 11th through the 17th. I hope you like this video. 
I hope it inspires you to try your own health and wellness spread. If it does, please consider liking and subscribing. Thank you.